out there. Um, and now we have a little break here before our mental tournament and then the heart of our season in January. So uh, I thought the uh, lightweights wrestled pretty good. We wrestled, you know, they have a nationally ranked team. They're ranked uh, top eight in the nation. They have three or four kids nationally ranked NAIA. So we knew we were in, um, in the thick of things in a couple of the matches. So I thought, uh, you know, the lightweights performed really well. And, uh, you know, and I'm sure the kids, uh, we have finals coming up. A lot of finals were this week, you know, the last week of school, so a lot of things going on. But we got our first uh, dual meet win, so the uh, the monkey's off our back, so to speak. But it's at a different different level, you know. I mean, uh, still couldn't go out there and under, underestimate, you know. But uh, just had to go out there and do what we work on every day. So uh, it feels good, honestly. Um, the whole year so far, we've been doing nothing but D1, D1 wrestling. So it's you know, it's been pretty tough, but uh, it's about time for a change. So we win today, and then we got a little time off, and come back, and we're ready to get those wins. Uh, we got a lot to work on. Uh, I mean, you know, watching today, I mean, we, we got we got the win, but you know, it should have been a little bit different match. Uh, you know, we got to work on our feet, we got to work on our conditioning. Um, I don't know, we got a lot. So. where we have our intercessions where we do most of our wrestling we have um, actually two almost a home event Menlo you know mm -hmm. 30 miles away is a tournament where we're going to do really well and then we have two division one dual meets after that at home on a Sunday against uh, Stanford and Bakersfield and then the real heart of our season is back to back to back where we're traveling three times we're going to Nebraska Kearney for four dual meets and then uh, we go to Baptist which is our, obviously one of our big rivals it should be some good matches and then we go to the RMAC Championships mm -hmm. in Colorado Springs at the uh, U.S. Uh, Olympic Training Center. So we're looking forward to that. So we just uh, get, try to get everybody healthy and uh, the guys back in the lineup. Mm -hmm. And uh, should be um, guys are working hard. So we're, we're going to take give them nine days off here coming up, and they, you know, with the loved ones, and <laughs> Christmas, and everything else, and get ready, get back on the drawing board here in January.